All right, season two is here. We here now. We might as well get started. Kobe. Let's jump in here. Let's jump in here. And this is my team. What are we doing? Pink Diamond. You see him? You see him? Pink Diamond Tyrese Halliburton. You know what I'm saying? All right, so poetry in motion. We got these poetry in motion. So we kicking with. The season is here, though. Let's see what the season consists of. You can get that Hall of Fame package. They got that Hall of Fame pack for you. Can I just get to... I want to get to the prizes, bro. All right. So uh, if you buy the Pro Pass, you get this helmet, this belt. You get a, a belt, okay? An on-fire belt. Season 2 Pro Pass pack with some shoes, some badges, some takeovers. You get a diamond Carl Anthony Towns for the Pro Pass. And then, you know, the Hall of Fame Pass gets you that 15% plus 10%, 10 level skips, 15 KVC. I mean, I, I don't know. Do I got the 20? All right, we got some team emotes. I see some shirts, Gravity Ball shirt. They got a Gravity Ball shirt in there. You get uh, Jamal Murray off top. He's evolutionary. You get some Ascension picks, My Court Gatorade mural. Who wants that? Okay, we got the robot face, 120 minutes, 84, uh, 84 at level four, 80, 84 pack and an 84 pack at level, at level five too. That's if you get the premium pass though okay uh let's see i'm just i mean i'm gonna get the premium pass so i'm looking at it y'all can look through these though and see what y'all like a tier two participation badge badge perk we got to see what that participation back badge is talking about ruby christian branham i don't know i don't know christian branham it's a lot of ascension picks here though and i think that's a buddy hill with an ascension pick it was a card for each ascension pick there's a buddy hill oh buddy hill is the prize buddy hill must be the prize for the ascension Okay, so jumping on that, I might want to get that Buddy Hill. That's a diamond to add to the collection. Hopefully, you can get there. An 87 pack at level 13. What else we got going? Another go kart skin at level 14. Um, I mean, it ain't looking too bad. 15, a 15 card badge pack. Pick five, and then pick five. 15 out of 15 shoes at level 16. You got 60 skill boosts, 10 games each, at level 17. What else we looking at? What's catching my eye? uh amethyst obi topping at level 20 that's looking good i want that stuff the magic dragon mascot too i'm i'm throwing that on how fast can you get to level 40 i want this media day hairstyle too the jimmy silk press we got to i'm rocking that jimmy silk press we making a video with that a, a takeover option badge pack so we get pick five out of 15 badges at level 23 along with the media day hairstyle what else we got going the gatorades 45 gatorades at level 24 iverson banner more ascension picks deluxe pack will spin at level 26 that's gonna be hot a, a 90 plus overall at level 25 and then a bronze silver and gold option pack picks pick five i don't know if that's pick five each it, sh it should be pick five each out of each uh pack that's if you get the premium pass though six 60 minute xp coins out of the premium pass at level 27 that's kind of crazy this deluxe badge, this deluxe pack will spin though at level uh, 26. Unauctionable is gonna be heavy. It's gonna be heavy. A 90 plus pack overall premium option pack at level 28 if you get that premium pass. So they really trying to push that premium pass. You get a max plus one badge perk and a Rocky Denver Nuggets at level 30. The Rocky Denver Nugget mascot. That mascot, that Nugget mascot might be hot. And a 90 plus overall. For season two 90 plus overall option pack that's all that's all at level 30 level 30 is gonna be hot um what else we got here what else am i seeing badge elevator instant plus two level boost you can level two at 33 all right a lot of ascension picks out here i see a lot of ascension picks 25 kmt at level 34 if you get that that uh that good old premium pass a deluxe badge will spin at level 34 too that's kind of crazy that's kind of crazy out here. It's looking heavy. This diamond James Worthy is looking heavy too. A 94 overall James Worthy at level 35. That's looking crazy. Um, what else we looking at? A Hall of Fame badge. You get a Hall of Fame badge at level 37. And if you get the if you get the premium pass, you get a Hall of Fame option pack. You get to pick one out of eight Hall of Fame badges as well as your Hall of Fame badge that you're getting from the just from the season two. So I mean if you're looking for them hall of fame badges that's two badges if you get that you know you get that little good old premium pass 
I don't know about I mean I'm not I'm not pushing the past but I'm not not pushing the past I'm letting y'all know transparency all transparency I'm getting it I'm I'm gonna ask my mom for 20 bucks so that I can get the premium pass no let me stop playing all right and then pink diamond holla burden holla burden at level 40 now what's gonna be the difference between these holla burdens though that's what I want to know because was there a difference between the McGrady's somebody said there was no difference between the McGrady's and honestly with the uh with the nba 2k database being currently down being reworked all season one i don't know it's looking shady maybe i don't know maybe the process of how he was getting his information has changed and he can't get it from 2k anymore if he was getting it from 2k i don't know how this i don't know how the website works i always wanted to ask brother how do you get your information so accurate how do you get all of these numbers somebody from 2k has to be giving you these numbers so who knows what's going on with 2k database that's honestly kind of kind of crazy it's kind of crazy like you're on the clock brother it's season two we need you to pop out and tell us what's the difference between these Halliburton's because if I go over here to to the manage my collection and try to see you know what's what season two this Halliburton we can see like this is the regular Halliburton. Yeah, this is the regular Tyrese. And then this is the, the Pro Pass Tyrese, Hall of Fame Pro Pass. They both the same height. I mean, <laughs> I just want to know like what's the difference going to be? You know what I mean? The three pointer is 94. The, it would honestly have to be six. It would have to be six. Y'all can go through this and tell me if you see any differences in the numbers or in the badges. But I don't know. You know, I honestly don't know. If we looking at number for number, if we going stroke for stroke on the number game, I see all the numbers probably the same. At a glance, they look the same. If I'm, I mean, you know, I'm not a, I'm not a Tesla robot, but if I can get my Tesla robot to scan these numbers, I would ask him, what's the difference? You know what I mean? Or maybe, uh, I don't know. Okay, we got 11 halves, eight gold, four silver, and three bronze out of him. And then over here, if we go over here, we got, are these the same yeah 11 8 4 and 3 so he got all the same badges i would implore y'all to try to figure out what's the difference what's the big idea 2k you know what what would be the difference because if the only difference is the nameplate and the the color art on the on the card that's kind of that's just kind of like uh, no advantage if you look at this carl anthony towns brother is a power forward center okay he plays both spots 6 11 that's not bad that's not bad with a 93 pointer okay what's the rebounding on him ball handle at 65 but the rebounding i'm looking for did i pass rebounding i think i passed it speed with ball 67 speed is 80 that's a nice speed for bro 80 vertical um hmm. 88 and 89 rebounding okay i mean it is what it is i want to look at james worthy too. Six nine james worthy playing the power forward small forward spot i'm not mad at a james worthy card this card comes out every year 78 three-point shot can he dribble a little bit he's almost at an 80 dribble at a 75 pass i mean it's not looking too bad 84 perimeter 84 interior 80 rebounding we can put him at the small forward spot he's gonna you know he's gonna be lanky in the paint at at six nine i mean james do his dang thing you know what i mean he do his dang thing we look at this jamal murray what is he hitting on he might be a budget card to get you through salary cap honestly if the jumper is nice 84 uh, 84 three point and mid range 86 ball handling nah if we're looking at the speed speed with ball 83 84 man nah. perimeter defense 72 i'm i'm not jacking it like that i mean it could be something could be not look at this ob topping real quick Let's see what ob topping's about 84 three point shot buddy is buddy might be one of them ones but he might be one of the ones that power forward with a 82 ball handle. It's kind of crazy. I mean, what more would you want to ask for out of your power forward? Besides, do you have some block on you? You got some 83 interior, 83 perimeter, 83, 84 rebounding, 86 speed, 87 speed with ball, bruh, 90s, 95 vertical. Pair that 95 vertical with a 95 drive and a standing. Obi Toppin's going to be that guy when you get to him. Obi Toppin, mark my words, it's about to be that guy. We can get to this Contavious Caldwell Pope. This might be the first card that I go grind towards with a 93 three-point shot small forward shooting guard. 
Yup, small forward shooting guard. Contavious Codwell Pope is gonna be one of them ones. 6'5", 204 pounds. Brother is not a slouch by any means. He got a 75 bar handle on him, 75 pass. I mean, the perimeter is 92, the interior is 82. So 92 perimeter, I don't think defense really matter that much this year though, honestly, the way I'm feeling, but I learned a little bit different. I learned a new method on defense. So it's, it's actually feeling a, a lot more worth having the higher defense. Now I'm gonna go try it out on the, my career side of things though, honestly. Five Hall of Fame badges, seven goals, two silver, four bronze. I, I'm digging it. We're going to try to get to bro as quick as possible. I might hop back in the salary cap and see what these prizes are on salary cap. A Duke, a, du a Dukes of Dunk Deluxe Box. You get 10 Deluxe Dukes of Dunks once you hit 5K points needed in salary cap. You got a Shattered Point at 25, 10K at 2,000 a hidden gem at 15 and 5,000 at 1,000. 75, 750 points, you get an 80 plus pack. 500 points, you get a shattered piece. 300 points, you get the variety shoe pack and a badge option pack at 125. So, I mean, yeah, I'm definitely about to hop back in the salary cap early. And, and you, we talked about the showdown prizes, which you're getting for showdown now. Um, the rewards have changed. The rewards have definitely changed. And I'm not trying to make this video run too long, but you can see right here, you get two NBA 25 Series 1 Deluxe Award Packs. You get some rep, a diamond shoe, a takeover award pack, a badge option pack, and a playbook option pack for the first reward. The second reward, unsellable, four Series 1 Deluxe Packs, three-point royalty base pack, rep, a diamond shoe, takeover award pack, badge option pack, and a playbook option pack, then 3500 for the last third prize that's kind of crazy and then if we look here we see that we got a uh, 120 wins gets you a hidden gems 92 plus overall pack unsellable a season one super pack 20 box unsellable a season two hall of fame badge option pack eight cards and 50k vc empty i'm sorry 50k empty for 60 wins it's a whole lot going on for 60 wins hidden gems you get a 90 plus hidden gem overall 287 overall premium player packs 384 plus premium player packs five poetry and motion deluxe packs all unsellable go option badge pick five silver option badge pick five bronze option badge pick five and 25k mt and then if you win 15 games over here in showdown you get an 87 plus overall premium player pack an 87 overall player award pack wonder what the difference is 280 plus overall premium player packs 284 plus overall player award packs and 5000 mt all that is unsellable um there was more i thought there was more prizes than that though i thought there was a 500 prize let me check okay yeah just as i suspected just as i suspected for 250 wins here you get a Hidden Gems 95 plus overall award pack and a legend badge. That's for 250 wins. So Showdown is showing love. Um, I mean, I'm trying to go get something. I'm not gonna hold you. I would like to be a part of that. When the Saints go marching in, I wanna be in that number. Honestly, honestly, I mean, what is Breakout talking about? They didn't change anything for Breakout. I, at least they didn't say they changed anything for Breakout, but for Triple Threat, for Triple Threat Park, they're giving up they're giving it up nasty for triple threat part. The thought was just to let y'all know real quick, because we, we hitting 20 minutes and I'm not trying to go over 20, 20 much, too much. So triple threat part, five wins, you get an 84 overall premium player pack. 10 wins, you get an 87 overall premium player pack. 25 wins, you get a 90 plus overall premium player pack. 50 wins, you get 25 K MT. 75 wins, you get an amethyst gems of the game option back. 100 wins, you're getting a diamond hidden gems pack. 150 wins, you're getting season two Hall of Fame badge option pack. For 200 wins, you're getting 50K MT. And for 500 wins, you're getting a hidden gems 95 overall award pack and legend badge. So yeah, they're giving it up. They're giving it up nasty out here for uh, season two. 
I wish that some of these prizes were a little bit more, eh, you know, a little bit more, a little bit more of that bang for your buck. But, uh, and I wish they would throw some locker codes, 2K. Y'all could throw some locker codes, honestly. Honestly. So, I mean, I got a lot of, ugh, to get to. Got a bunch of grind to get in it for, you know what I mean? Yeah, we on the clock right now. Y'all be cool. Your booze mean nothing. I've seen what makes you cheer.